Yeah. Hi. Uh, so please introduce yourself. Hey everybody, my name is Brandon. I'm with J5 Create. We're based out of Atlanta, Georgia. And uh, what do we see here? So this is a uh, USB 4 dock we have here. Uh, it's a triple 4K 60 dock. So you've got three different ports right here. HDMI, display port if you need it. Uh, USB-C, got some Type A right here for data transfer, Ethernet port, micro SD, got your mic and speaker, there's a locking mechanism there, and then that's your power in port over there. That's a lot of stuff just through one Type C. It is, you're right about that, yeah, definitely. A lot of 4Ks. A lot, yeah, yeah that triple 4K, triple 4K 60, that's right. Um, like I said, plugs right into your computer, plug and play, no need to install any drivers or anything of that nature. What do nature. we see here? So this right here is our host cable, so this is what you'd plug right into your computer, and um, comes right out of there, into your laptop, whatever you need. And this right here is just a cover for it, in case you want to put your laptop on top of it or whatever. It does use USB 4 technology, Intel technology, um, and this is something that will be coming to market within uh, within the year, likely. That, that means there's an Intel chip in there that kind of enables this? That's right, Intel controller, that's correct. The controller, right? That's right. So is it uh, top of the line? Uh, is it not possible to have more functionality through Type-C? Uh, through Type-C, well, yeah, yeah, yes, actually. Uh, Thunderbolt 5 is uh, up in uh, coming technology. It's new and emerging. We have a dock over here, actually. Maybe we can go over that one. Uh, it uses Thunderbolt 5 technology, but this uses USB 4, which is still top of the line. Is it uh, 40 gigabit per second? No. Um, I, I believe Thunderbolt 4, 30, 40 gigabit per second, yes. Thunderbolt 5, I want to say it's 80 gigabits per second. But So this is 40 gigabit? Data transfer, yeah, 40 gigabits For per second. For all these... Mm -hmm. USB hosts and everything all That's at the right. same time. That's right, 4 gigabits per second. Yep. That's, That's cool. Right. All the new uh, MacBooks support USB 4? Yes, they do. Yeah. Th Thunderbolt, Thunderbolt 4, yeah. Uh, since the, the M1 MacBooks, Is the M1 all MacBooks? the M... Yeah, I believe, they, I believe they do. Most of them support USB 4, Thunderbolt 4, um, all of the Macs. I know Mac had a problem for a few years where they were using mainly Thunderbolt or uh, USB ports on everything. But yes, they do support uh, uh, Thunderbolt 4, yes. All right. And uh, here you have... Uh, USB 5? That's Thunderbolt, uh, Thunderbolt 5. 5 right here. That's a dock. One yeah. of their products still in development, still something that's not, you know, like I said, not totally out there yet, but that's Thunderbolt 5. It's dual AK60. Um, so you've got your USB uh, Thunderbolt ports on the front. You've got a few on the back there. Again, a port for your host cable as well, Ethernet, etc. Everything you could, you could possibly need. And it also actually has a uh, NVMe uh, drive slot on the bottom of it as well. All right. Uh, let me try to let me try to capture. Is it connected right now? Uh, so there's two two displays. Uh, where where did the how did the displays connect? Is it uh, display port? I'm sorry. Uh, what kind of displays? What kind of space? Uh, displays. Oh, display. Oh, uh, dual AK60. Uh, it's just a uh, Type C getting out of there. All right. That's All right. What makes it, makes so um, you always you want to work with the latest chips? Sure, sure. A lot of partnership with the Intel? Right, yeah, controller. partnership with Intel, that's right. That's what we did with Thunderbolt 4, uh, 5 over there, and then the USB 4 is here as well. Uh, we have a lot of products that are partnered with Intel, yes. And what do we see here? So this right here, this is uh, more of a layman's dock. It's um, dual 4K, uh, one 4K 60, one 4K 30. Uh, just a different style dock that's set up. You know, got your usual ports, Ethernet, etc. Um, but, you know, obviously going to be a lower price point there entering compared to some of the higher end docks we have. But that's one of our newer ones, like I said, in a more uh, layman model. And actually, it's got a uh, wireless charging function right there on the top. So you can charge your iPhone or whatever if you have MagSafe. Come to the stand or you can lay it down flat. Be nice if the the wireless connector also had video and data throughput. Oh, video and data throughput. Yeah, we're uh, we're not there yet, but uh, we do have that on Max. Hey, just a fun little feature, you know. Is this the panoramic camera? That's right. That's what you're seeing right here on top. So. This, we have a bunch of cameras like this, conference cameras. This one right here, I believe it's 4K. Yep, yep, so it's basically yep. a 360 Everything degree camera. Yeah. Uh, it uses uh, facial recognition, voice tracking essentially. And what you're doing there is just rotating, tracking people in a conference room, whatever. And what the marquee event about this one is that it's 4K. So we're looking at 4K at 30 Hertz. Like I said, that's one of our newer ones as well. All right. So how does that work? It? So essentially, it, it's like I said, it's designed to uh, use facial recognition. So it actually comes with this remote here. So if we change one of the modes, like if we go to this one um, right here. So again, see how it's changing? See that? So what's going on there is that it's tracking who's talking, who's in the frame, right? And it's picking up audio. So this is the perfect type of camera for a conference room, any of that nature. What you're going to do there is you're going to have it zoom right into whoever's talking, and you're good to go from there. So it's just uh, 
anybody around? That's right. And the reason it sits is doing what it is because there's a lot of stimulation, you know, a lot of people around here, everything. But in a conference room, this is uh, this and is the ultimate 360 machine. 360 right microphones here. also. I'm sorry. It's also 360 microphone. It just captures anywhere people are. Believe, yes, it does. Yep, it has a. Uh, Omnidirectional microphone. So yes, there's uh, multiple right. microphones in there that are all set up to, to capture from across the room. All right. Thanks a lot. Absolutely, man.